Special, Race Across America 2009 with Vico Merklein. Imagine racing six marathons a day. Also race across America is, to me, uh, Race Across America is the meine, toughest meine and most demanding race, race in the world. Und anstrengendste Radrennen der Welt. And I don't think I really knew what it would take until we got to California. The route is 3,000 or so miles long. Our goal was to be the first hand cycling team to finish in the official time in less than nine days. Also, the team name can be Venture. The team name can be Venture was invented by Carlos and Pat, if I'm not mistaken. And it says it all. We can do it. So, dass dass man sich das Ziel setzt, dass wir es schaffen können. Also die Teamunterteilung war bei uns so. Our crew breakdown was as follows. There were four cyclists: Carlos, Pat, Hannes, and myself, who split into two rotating teams. Each team had to ride for six hours and then had six hours break. And during the six recovery hours, I guess I would get some two to three hours sleep at most. It's it's really important to to eat, to stay hydrated, and to sleep. And all of those things are almost impossible in a race like this. The first three days, the first three days were okay. The body wasn't worn out yet. But during the last three to four days, I was miles away. I needed someone to wake me up when it was my turn because I couldn't do it on my own anymore. The changing landscape, that's how I knew that I was moving from A to B. Right after the start, we had to climb the mountains, the first four hours. And I thought, if this is the beginning, what will I do when we get to the Rocky Mountains? Before the Rockies, we rode through the desert at about 40 degrees centigrade in the shade. That's when you find out what it takes to ride in the sun. You use 50 sunblock and it instantly melts off your arms. And by the evening, you're sunburned despite putting on sunblock three to five times a day. That was amazing. To see the green after the desert on the way to the Rockies, turning from grey to an array of colours, it's astonishing. There are so many impressions. I still have to process all of them. Man hat auch so viele Eindrücke, so viele Bilder, dass man es jetzt noch nicht verarbeitet. The last 24 hours without sleep, just racing. I remember brushing my teeth until my mouth bled because I was so angry. And my crew, they kept their distance. They knew that I was not in the best of moods. Just to do the 3,000 miles. That's extreme on its own. Also, this alone is already really heavy, yeah. But when you add 100,000 feet of gradient to that, it's like climbing Mount Everest at least three times. Getting up there once in nine days should already be enough. But three times, as I sit here now, I still can't believe it. So it's great that we've made it. And people were there to cheer us on and to interview the guys and that was, we were all just like, oh, we made it, we made it, it's great and everyone's safe and healthy and it was, just, just finishing the goal was, was excellent. Uh, but I would definitely support someone again. Yeah, also, I think my head would say, never again.